We saw Jerry Jones with Jamie Foxx. Looking at meats. <laughs> he don't give a damn. See, he normally, them, they, they supposed to be out there scouting talent. You know, white man always been, you know, mysterious, wondering what we got between our lid and yeah. Jerry Jones and one of them ones. Like, you thought he was looking back in the 60s at them niggas? He was trying to see you. <laughs> what we had. You know, see, God show him it's not even dealing. Go look at that picture Jerry Jones got when he was doing that. He, he, was, he was trying to see me because he had heard. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. I gotta ask something real uh -oh, quick. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Um, oh, she come in. That's how she come in. Up. How many <laughs> cowboy jerseys you have? Because you always <laughs> throwing them in the trash, burning them, or doing something like that. I'm like, he gonna have to run out of it. Why you keep going and buying new ones? Because Why? You, you know, not... My method is, you know, I, I I like to give game. People be like, I know you went back and got that jersey. That's what I be thinking. I spent 150 on a jersey, right? But I made 2500 off the video. It's wow. It's so a, you it's really... A, it's a method. So you really burn it. You really trash it. Not, well, you not really burn it. burn it, but I trash it. Like the last video I did with the Cowboys, yeah. I, that was that was in Raleigh, North Carolina. Once I dropped that... And you didn't go video, back in there and get it. It's over with really? once I drop it. It's mud, dirt, food. <laughs> Yeah. You should just give it away to somebody else. Somebody would have wanted it. Nah, they'll be all right. They do better without that cowboy jersey. They'll be all right. They don't need that one. Man. They don't need that one. So let's be real for a second. Where where will we be? The, are we going to be in the playoffs, Super Bowl? What are we doing this year? Dallas Cowboys. It's going to be a long year, brother. And I'm talking about long year, brother. It's, it ain't looking good for us. Not at all. Nah, we can't run the ball, bro. If you can't run the ball, you damn sure ain't gonna build a pass the ball. Then they go get Zeke or something. Who, who, back. Who? He back. <laughs> who? He back. Man, you can get back there and do what he's doing. He ain't doing shit. He wouldn't even be playing. Nigga, fix that wall. Man, you know, and and, and I don't. I, we on the Cowboys. We got to stay I on. Got, I want to ask him about that. I know too. what you about now. I know what you about now. I know what you about now. Let me ask you this: <laughs> Everybody saw Jerry Jones with Jamie Foxx. Looking at meats. <laughs> he don't give a damn. See, he normally, them, they, they supposed to be out there scouting talent. You know, white man always been, you know, mysterious, wondering what we got between our lid. And yeah. Jerry Jones is one of them ones. Like, you thought he was looking back in the 60s at them niggas? He was trying to see you. <laughs> what we had. You know, see, God show him it's not even dealing. Go look at that picture Jerry Jones got when he was doing that. He, he, was, he was trying to see you because he had heard. That, that we got things like sausages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we <laughs> big big time. So he wants our own team, and then ever since then he been amazed by our packages. And he really, so he go in the dressing room just to see that. Absolutely. But did you he see? Told you. Did you see Jamie Fox when he him too? He said him too. Him too. Him what? Y'all know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We, we've heard a lot of things. You know, allegedly <laughs> things have been allegedly coming out. Yeah, I'm too. J and and I love you my can't brother. talk about my Jamie nah, now. He can be your oh, Jamie. He can be your Jamie. There's a lot of stuff being said. Mama, mama, mama. That's Johnny Gill. Him too. Him too. Oh, damn. Who? Him too. Jay, that's my cousin. I heard about that. They say that's my cousin. He got a soft spot for brothers. No, man. That's just what they say allegedly. That's my cousin. He got a soft spot for brothers I'm tired of hearing about all these allegedly. Legend. If if all these legends, we gotta are, say that though. Hold on. If no no no. If all these alleged are <laughs> That's true, the only we say it. Hold on. If all these legends are true, then who is straight? Me. She. I can't <laughs> speak for nobody else. <laughs> I can't speak for nobody she. else. She. You know what, man? I when I seen that that. I was like, damn, they live. When people get older, they start letting stuff out. Man, they man. normally let me tell you some real talk. Jerry Jones don't say that to somebody around that he ain't comfortable with. Wow. So obviously. There's been some conversations before for him to say that. And he didn't know he was on live. No, he, he probably he knew. knew. He, he knew. Started in the I don't think. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Before, but he, he why, knew. Why, why was he so comfortable to say that with Jamie? Think about it. Think about that. And a lot of people, I've heard Damn. a lot of people said that if it was them, they would have, before they cut it off, they would say, what you talking about? Just to try to clear themselves. To make it sound like, you know what? He not in no cahoots. You know, I feel like that's no Jerry Jones. What you talking about? Nah, nah, nah but nah, you gotta nah, understand, nah. Jamie. This Jamie versus the Jamie before he got sick is mm -hmm. a. I hadn't seen this Jamie that much. Y'all might have. I hadn't seen him. He don't come out. He like don't he come used out to. very often. So mm -hmm. it's a different. I mean, when you see him, not you to, like damn. So many, so much. You know, is he a clone? It, it, yeah. it gets so much with yeah. Jamie. Jamie is a huge figure, bro. Yeah, like so he, he ain't coming out. 
Right now he he playing he ducked off. He yeah. don't even come out like that. But you gotta to. think. And I hate saying this. And uh -oh. he used to talk about that. Uh oh. You know, Jamie used to throw parties too. Hanging out with Puff like back in the day. I would hang out and watch him throw parties. He's not Studio, coming out because once tapes. the P Diddy stuff started going on, he's like, let me let me just sit right here. I don't until blame him. Why, Allegedly, why they, so? they say it was some stuff with him and Diddy when the whole sickness thing started. That was one of the things they was really yeah. talking yeah. about. Yeah. They was they was like, it's something went on with he yeah. said something and it, it got out and then this happened. This is the stuff we hear. Yeah. And I'm nobody, not not, I'm not hoping not. Even if Jamie ever I allegedly participated in any of them activities. At the end of the day, that's their business. They grown mm -hmm. men, you know. They can do what they want to do. It's not breaking the law to throw like, parties. No, but I, I hate the fact that the world we live in, we we, we constantly bringing our brothers yeah. down, and yeah. our brothers are allowed themselves to be so weak yeah. to be in no kind of freak offs like that, man. If I'm a uh -huh. freak off, it's gonna be with women, not with dudes. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna be in the room with another guy butt naked. You know what I'm saying? I'm not finna no, do me all neither, that. But I, the freak off word terminology, when you say it, you know, it's just a, it's amplifying the situation, the freak yeah. off. Like, I never heard that terminology to here lately. Was that what he called it? Or where did the freak off word come from? Think about you in the freak it off. I don't no, know. No, I'm saying. White people. people. That's where it come from. Like, it's white a freak people. off. White people come, created that word freak off. Yeah. When it first popped off, when they had went and got him and picked him up, then and they say he had a freak off. That one time too. They was in there having sex with, with, with men and women allegedly, women, and Diddy yeah, was getting behind them. How you move your hips like that? Freak to, off. The, to the guys, not to the women. How you move your hip like that? You give an extra push when you do that. Like, it, it, it was. <laughs> what? <laughs> he was, I'm being honest, so man. He was, it was an art to it. He it was, was trying to figure out. Where did you hear that from? was watching niggas' hips. The way they move. The way they. And it's fascinating. And that's how he came out with that. Harlem shake shit. <laughs> that was from watching other men and uh, <laughs> doing all that. Oh, I'm not lying. Yeah. Man, I'm, not, I'm, I'm being serious. Yeah, I'm the floor that's what he was saying. Shit, yeah. A freak off. He was studying people. How and they move their bodies. You know. But you know, I feel like. The reason why a lot of them got caught up in doing, you know, not just females, I feel like there's a lot of drugs got into it. Cause when you, man, what drug make me want another man? No, what but hold on. They when I say that, when I say that, because then if you, <laughs> no. if you doing all these drugs, then you don't know what you're doing, and you having threesomes, and you're supposed to be with a girl, and then you know you don't know what you know. What? It just went left. After no, that. I don't go that left. Uh, I don't go. It don't left. never go that left. You Ew. know something ain't right now when you having sex with a girl. Just for big, if you in a room with another guy and he got another chick, and if that nigga staring at me, no, I ain't got going instead of what he I'm doing. I'm not gonna be party in there. Uh uh, and I'm not in there with him. Shouldn't be in there no way. You know no. how I dig it talk? Damn, money. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you working with? You money? said last time, like, you you know, when he talked to me, he said, man, you know, baby, like, 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 what, what's man, up? Man, you know? On, it, it's it's bad. Like it's some p things that were said that you can't unhear. Yeah. That you can't unsee. These are things you can't. I know Biggie not happy. I know Biggie. Miss Viola Wild. You see her? What she said? I saw she that. gonna slap the dog. She, she got sick of this. I saw that. Her, her son and put his life on the line for this. Yeah, man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One On One. One On One. Yeah, we gonna talk.